In this video, we will be discussing how to take a payment for current customers in SiteLink when using storable payments. We'll first start with SiteLink Web Edition. From the Operations page, click on Payments. Locate the tenant or unit you would like to take a payment for and click Next. If the customer has more than one unit, select the unit they are making a payment for in the top left corner. You can also add merchandise, insurance charges, or edit charges from the bottom right hand corner of the screen. In the payment section, enter the amount to be paid, select the payment method from the method drop down menu. If the tenant is paying by credit card, Enter the payment information or swipe the credit card. And click OK to process the payment. If the customer paid with a credit card, you will be prompted to enter the tenant's billing address and credit card CVV. These fields are required when processing a one-time payment that is manually entered into the software. If you already entered the CVV in the CVV2 field on the previous screen, it will auto -filled, be auto-filled in the pop-up. If the tenant's billing address is the same as the tenant's address on file, you can click Auto-fill with tenant address to fill in the postal code and billing address fields. And then click OK to complete the payment. You will then receive prompts to print or email receipts depending on your setup. If the tenant is paying by ACH, in order to accept ACH payments, you must first have ACH enabled in program defaults. Select ACH Bank Debit from the menu method dropdown. Enter the customer's account number, routing number, and select an account type from the dropdown menu. Then click OK to complete the payment. Again, you will then receive prompts to print or email receipts depending on your setup. Offline payments. You may need to record an offline payment if a transaction was processed but not recorded in SiteLink, such as during an internet connectivity issue. If you need to record an offline payment in order to bring SiteLink into balance with a processed transaction, Select Offline Credit Card from the Method dropdown. Fill out the amount, credit card number, expiration date, and enter an authorization code. Then click OK to record the payment. Now we will switch over to SiteLink MyHub. Once logged in, select Operations and then Payments from the left side menu. Double click on the tenant that you would like to take a payment for. If the customer has more than one unit, you can select the unit they are making a payment for in the unit section. Enter the amount of the payment and the payment information in the fields under make a payment. If there is a credit card saved on file, you can select it from the drop-down menu. Click Submit to process the payment. If the tenant has paid with a credit card, you will be prompted to enter the tenant's billing address and credit card CVV. These fields are required when processing a one-time payment that is manually entered into the software. If you have already entered the CVV and the CVV2 field on the previous screen, it will be auto-filled in the pop-up. If the tenant's billing address is the same as the tenant's address on file, you can click auto-fill with tenant address to fill in the postal code and billing address fields.